Hello and welcome everyone on this quick session on Linux KVM. My name is Yogesh Mehta. I will be instructor for uh, this particular course. In this quick training on KVM, we are going to discuss following topics with appropriate lab at uh, end of every session. So you will be learning what is a hypervisor, which is very important thing to learn before uh, going on to any virtualization technology like uh, Zen, KVM or Hyper-V or VMware. Then uh, as the session is on KVM, we will discuss uh, KVM, its pros and cons and uh, the main terminologies which we will be using in this particular training. After that, uh, I will take you to lab where we will discuss lab details, prerequests for KVM installation for your lab setup. Then we will do KVM installation. Next thing is KVM network configuration. After that, uh, we will configure storage pool to be used by KVM virtual machines. Then we are going to create a couple of virtual machines, which will be our guest virtual machines. Then I will talk about uh, how you can manage the guest virtual machines. Basically, what are the day-to-day -day things which you can do on your virtual machines like stop, start, taking console, increasing the resources, etc. The main uh, thing after this one is uh, how you can take backup of your guest virtual machines because that is important thing. After that, uh, we will talk about how you can do expansion of disk sizes on a guest machine. How you can take snapshots of a virtual machine in case you have to restore, what steps you need to follow to do the restore. How you can do a renaming of a guest virtual machine. After that, uh, we will talk about how we can uh, achieve resource increase on a guest virtual machines. Then we will talk about how you can clone a guest virtual machine from any existing machine or you can say any existing template. So this is agenda. Apart from this, uh, we will be discussing a couple of things about troubleshooting and uh, performance monitoring on KVM. At the end, we will be having a quick brainstorm session to enhance the learning experience. So it will give comfort to you guys like you have learned something in case you have doubt uh, you can uh, always put a question uh, on my channel or Udemy so that's something I'm always open to help and uh, I'm sure you will enjoy and learn from this session thank you guys